Chris, WahhabiKing.com, and we've got the new Multistar uh, Travel Backpack Deluxe version. Now, this is uh, unlike any other uh, backpack out there for multi-rotor use. Uh, there's been a lot of uh, customization as well as uh, uh, comfort features that have been added to this particular backpack, unlike any other one on the market uh, itself. So let's go ahead and dive into it. We'll talk about some of the features as far as the uh, comfort is concerned, and then we'll dive on to the inside and see what uh, all you can pack into this thing. So first thing that I want you guys to note on this is the, uh, the, uh, the material and the strapping uh, for it. Unlike a standard backpack and the other ones on the market that just have two straps coming straight down, this has a basically like a, a neck support on the back that creates a nice V pattern that keeps those uh, straps right across uh, your shoulder and across the back of your neck so you don't have those, uh, they're not trying to slip off onto the sides of those. On the back side of these, uh, these straps, it has a really nice uh, webbing material which is uh, really light against your skin so you're not gonna have sweating issues into there and a nice airflow on it. Other thing uh, that this has that other ones don't have on the market is a chest strap and that is really nice. It stops it from slipping off if you're doing some running, climbing, hiking, uh, you know, bringing your multi-rotor along with you on your adventures. So that, that's a really nice feature right there. And it has some loops in it with elastic, which allows it to stretch a little bit. So as you breathe and stretch and move around, that's uh, a really nice feature itself. Now, the other one is right down here, and this is your waist strap. It, uh, it just uh, snaps right in there, and it has the two little uh, pillars along the side. And this waist strap uh, transfers some of that weight right onto your hips itself, and that uh, allows it to uh, definitely be able to carry more weight. Uh, you don't have any fatigue or any issues with those uh, uh, as well. And the other thing is, is that also secures and stabilizes the backpack. Definitely allows you to do a lot of adventure sports and climbing and, and getting where you normally wouldn't with the backpack sliding all over or trying to come off. So that waist strap is really nice. Now if I lift up this webbing, you can also see from the waist strap and along to the bottom where it's attached right here, it has that really nice V pattern in there. So it's very comfortable to wear this backpack. Uh, one of the nicest ones on the markets, uh, we've looked at other ones and it's just two straps and it's kind of more of a utilitarian where this actually uh, gives you some comfort. Now on the outside, there's three uh, pouches available. We've got a Velcro style right over here. Very uh, rigid uh, material. Now this is a uh, hybrid uh, nylon type of material. It's waterproof, uh, wear and tear resistant as well. Uh, on the other side, more of a webbing, so you could put a water bottle or, or some looping or whatever you have in here, cabling. And then a really nice big uh, zipper pack right here on the outside that allows you to put all kinds of stuff, such as props, right on uh, the outside itself. So it's a really nice square backpack. Now, unlike a lot of backpacks that unzip from the top and you pull everything out the top, this one opens up more like luggage. So we're gonna go ahead and just unzip the dual zippers on both sides, and we're gonna pop this on open. Now it has a pouch on the inside, right here that allows you to uh, put even more things such as spare props or uh, cables or whatever you have and you're going to notice the inside of this. Uh, in here we've got a uh, DJI uh, Vision 2 or Phantom style. We've got the, uh, the transmitter up here. We've got spots for batteries. We've got spots for cables or Fat Shark uh, FPV goggles, uh, all kinds of different rooms. Now this backpack was designed right around the DJI Phantom and the Vision uh, 2 series of multi-rotors. They slip right in here but of course you can adapt it to any multi-rotor that's in that size class such as the Quantum Nova. Uh, if you just enlarge these holes a little bit with a knife, they'll slip right on in on that one as well. Uh, a wide range of uh, transmitters as well. So a little DIY, you can use this backpack even for 250s. I actually have one of these that I've actually just slipped this foam insert out and uh, went to any uh, general camera store and you can buy the, uh, the DIY or, or make your own foam inserts and just put it on in there. And I've actually been able to put three 250 quads on their side transmitter and full FPV gear in this backpack and used it uh, to do some FPV hiking with it. So guys, this is the new Multistar backpack. This is definitely the ultimate, wait, just get that zipped up. It is definitely the ultimate uh, accessory. If you guys want to take your multi-rotor to do some aerial photography in some places that are pretty remote or just hauling it around, not only that for storage on the go, if you have your batteries and your transmitter all charged up and it's ready to go and it's sitting by your door, you're gonna be more likely to just grab it and snatch it and go uh, on, on your adventure with it versus, uh, oh, you know, I've gotta put it all together, get it loaded up. Uh, so it's, it's a real nice storage and having it ready to go uh, option. And as you can see, it uh, size and stylish as far as that is concerned, really nice uh, backpack itself. So this is the new uh, Deluxe backpack from Multistar. It's up on the new items page. And as always guys, subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'd love to hear back from you guys. Check it out. We'll see you guys next time. So